There are three scenarios for the future. So let's start with the bad one. Uh, in the first scenario, no more you and I, the end of Homo sapiens. 99.9% .9 of all species that ever lived on this planet, eventually they lost, so they are gone. And uh, of course, we need to remember that when we talk about saving the planet, that's not really the issue. Planet Earth will be fine and around for at least a billion years. This is about us. For how long will we be on this planet? And what will that future look like? The second scenario is a little bit more inspiring. I refer to it as the unimaginable growth scenario. Unimaginable because we can't even fantasize about how that future will look like. Maybe we have created super intelligence. So today's problems are just silly, easy. Things like cancer, climate change, that was nothing. Or maybe we have colonized the universe so we have new planets, new homes. So it doesn't matter if this one is polluted. So as you can imagine in this scenario, uh, future is so different, so we will have a hard time to understand it. Just like if we brought someone from the Stone Age here today and tried to explain what was going on. And then there is the third scenario, the sustainable future, the circular scenario. So even though we are 10 or maybe even 11 billion on this planet, so we have grown from a small world on a big planet to a big, big world on a small planet, we somehow managed to transform and change our behavior and our business models. So to create more with less and thereby we can actually continue to enjoy life on this beautiful planet in a circular, sustainable way. So which one of these scenarios will it be? Uh, that's up to us, of course. But remember that when you hear a, a tech vision about the future, it might sound very exciting and interesting, but remember one thing about technology, it doesn't care. Technology has no agenda, it doesn't want anything. So the question is not what will it be, but what do we want it to be? What's our vision? Hi, thank you for watching. My name is Stefan Hütforsch and I'm a futurist. That basically means I study trends and then I think and I talk and I write about these trends to um, try to understand and see the bigger picture. And of course, to help others like yourself to understand the future and, and embrace change. This video also marks the start of something I haven't done before, YouTube speeches. So I want to try to meet my audience, not only at business conferences, but anywhere, anytime. And, and more importantly, I, I want your input. I want you to be part of it, your thoughts, your questions, and your future visions. So I will do my part and post um, travel videos, journeys to the future, short clips and speeches like, like the one you just saw. And I invite you to travel with me. We will talk about the future work. Will, will it be all about AI and robots? And, and if so, what about us? And uh, we will talk about um, the gig economy. So if you want to know more about how I and other freelancers uh, manage our business and how we make money and everything else, we will talk about that. We will talk about um, the future of energy, education, transportation, media, money, uh, health, food, exercise, and of course, we will address the big problems like uh, climate change, pollution and inequality. And we will try to understand what all this means to our way of living. If you find this interesting, hit subscribe on my YouTube channel and uh, work with me in the comment section. Uh, yeah, and one more thing about the future. The poet T.S. Eliot taught us. It's uh, the journey, not the arrival that matters. So I see you in the future. <laughs>